go through a real life example on a WordPress website how you might be having some indexing issues uh, and the two most common causes around discouraging search engines and the robots.txt file. So if you've pulled up your SEMrush site audit and it's done this and said there's an error that it's failed, well, that's not too great. That means that there's some underlying problem under the hood. So I'm going to head back to my website here. The first thing I'm going to do is right click view page source, right? That's where I like to start with a lot of these issues. And I'm looking for a tag at the top here that says meta name robots no index or you can control f for no index if you see that that's not good right if it says index happy days no index bad time so that tells me one problem that's going on now i need to find what else could be going on so to do that i need to go to robots.txt and i can see i've got a robots.txt file you might get a 404 if you don't have one um, but I've got a problem here because what it's saying is user agent everyone, so asterisk is everyone, disallow all site files and folders. Well, that's not good for me at all because search engines aren't going to be able to look at my website. So to fix both these issues, I need to head to the dashboard and I'm going to move my camera over here. And what I've now need to figure out is what's going on. So if I head to Yoast, which is under the SEO tab here, if you don't have Yoast, go over to plugins, add new, and go ahead and search for Yoast and install Yoast. Once that's done, head back down here. You can see SEO and you can see tools. We're going to go to file editor. And we can see straight away our robots.txt. If you don't have one, it's going to have a button here to prompt you to create one. You can go ahead and do that if you are looking to create a robots.txt. But now I can see my file, I can see disallow all. That's not what I want. What I want to do is come up with a different code. So I want to do WP admin, right? Or just a check. You can copy and paste the recommended one over here. Yep, WP admin and that all checks out so now i'm just disallowing the admin dashboard rather than everything else that's going on now i'm going to hit save changes to my robots.txt and i fixed one part now all i've got to do is a very common issue i've got to head to settings I've got to head to reading and if i scroll to the bottom here you're going to see search engine visibility and unfortunately i have this box tick that says discourage search engines from indexing this site. Well, that's not what I want to do. I want to encourage search engines to index my site. So I'm going to click that off and save the changes. Now, it's very common for when you set your website live or you've just had a developer go that they leave this on while it's in development, but then forget to do it once it's live. And a lot of people see that. Now, if I head back to my website, I'm going to check those two issues, view the page source. Oh, great. Index, that's amazing. What about my robots.txt? How are we looking over there? And that looks fantastic too. So if I head back to SEMrush and I rerun my site audit, hopefully I'm going to see this crawling, ticking along, and then reach the end. Amazing. I can already see it crawling through, and very soon it will have a complete crawl. And I can then go through the rest of the issues and hopefully walk you through some of those most common ones in other videos.